If you haven't already, go and check out me and my fiance's gaming channel. The link will be in the description. Hey guys, it's Fantasia, and welcome to a, another mod overview. So this is another career mod, and it is the real estate career. Um, so it's by Sims underscore Lover, and this looks really cool. So I'm, so, you guys know, I'm so into career mods for some reason, even if they just work like a regular career. I don't know. I guess it's because like even if a new career gets added into the game, like with a pack. I'm always so excited. I don't know. Like, we always need more career options. So, this one just seems interesting, and it's something that we don't have, like, any sort of real estate career, you know? So, this is cool. Um, So, real estate career. Buy or buy. <laughs> Rent, buy, or sell property for clients. Perform duties such as study, property, listings, um, interview, prospective clients, accompany clients to... Um, properly cite, discuss conditions of sale, and draw up models of homes and real estate contracts. So this is base game compatible, which is great. <laughs> um, so it's ages young adult to elder. I actually like that it says that, so that's awesome because sometimes I know when I did my uh, mod review for the college career or whatever, um, I did get some questions about if teens can... Um, go to that career and I'm pretty sure the creator actually made it so your teens can go. So that's pretty cool. <laughs> so level one is a real estate receptionist, 20 simoleons per hour. Uh, oh, do you work like Monday? Wait, is this just Monday and Friday or Monday to Friday? Because here it says Saturday to or Tuesday to Saturday. But then this one has a question mark in the middle, so I'm not really sure. I don't know. We'll see. <laughs> and then skills needed is charisma one, greeting clients, schedule appointments, manage incoming phone calls, and provide customer service to real estate agents. Uh, your charisma skills are very important to this job. Okay. Good to know. And then um, level two is real estate agent, um, 35 an hour, Monday to Friday, I'm assuming. <laughs> um, skills needed, charisma level three. You are still working behind a computer doing the same old skills, but you are now able to write agreements between home buyers and agents. Okay, cool. Um, level three is buyers and agent. Oh, okay. <laughs> I was like, wait, what? Um, $50 or simoleons an hour, um, Tuesday to Saturday, skills needed, charisma four, and photography level two. Okay, that's kind of cool. I like that. You're finally out of the office now. You'll be placing for sale signs in the front yard, placing door hangers on doors, taking pictures of properties, and the sign or in assisting <laughs> real, um, real estate agents with open uh, houses. Okay, so level three and four are actually called the same thing, apparently. Um, I got confused for a second. Wait, what? <laughs> so this one, is this a mistake or is this actually, maybe this is meant to be here. I don't know, to be honest. Um, Cause this one you need photography. This is $50 an hour and then this is 40. Okay, interesting. Um, so this is Monday to Friday, skills needed charisma level five, following up on the maintaining client and agent referrals and working with home buyers. Keep growing those skills of yours. So level five is seller's agent, 150 an hour. So we're getting up there. Um, so this one is you work on Monday, Wednesdays, Fridays, and Saturdays. Skills needed is charisma level six, and you are showing homes all over the town on your own cool. <laughs> Make sure to close those deals and keep up with the, with the charisma skills. Okay, so level six is dual agent, 200 an hour, Monday, Wednesday, Friday, um, level seven of the charisma. You now represent both the seller and the buyer in the same transaction. Remember to keep information and confidential from both parties. Okay. Um, level seven is commercial agent, 225 an hour, Tuesday, Friday. See, is this just Tuesday? And I don't know, to be honest, you guys, we will see. <laughs> I'm assuming like it's just Tuesday to Friday, but there's a question mark and these have a dash. I don't know. Um, okay. So you need level eight of charisma and you have been selling homes, but now you work for companies who have been hired through your agency who are in need of a business. Okay. Um, and then level eight is surveyor, um, 250 an hour, Monday to Friday, skills needed, charisma level nine. As a survey surveyor, <laughs> you'll use your experience to survey the houses and find out how much they are worth and how much they're worth and report back to the agency 
agency you work for. Okay, level nine is office manager, 350 an hour, Monday to Friday, skills needed, charisma level 10. And you head back to the office, but this time you are overseeing the real estate receptionist, um, assistance agents, and reporting back to the agency owner. Make sure you have reached max charisma skills here. Okay, and then level 10. So this is a level 10 career, which is awesome. Some of them are only level five, level six, you know, so this one is the full 10. So agency owner, 500 an hour, Tuesday to Friday, no skills needed. Okay, that's cool. Um, all those stock options paid off. Now that you've given more liquid, you can pick and choose which struggling little startups will earn your magnanimity, as well as your prestige of your name as a backing of their work. Okay, you guys, so we're gonna jump into game. I'm excited. Okay, so we have our sim here. You guys saw me use the sim for the um, animal rescue mod career, um, which I loved. <laughs> so I'm using her again just because I love her. I kind of, I tend to do this thing where like, I'll use the same sims for a few like mod reviews and then I'll switch them out. Um, so yeah, just so you know. <laughs> um, so yeah, we're using her again. We'll probably use the male sim one more time too and then I'll switch to a different family for um, a couple other ones. So here we go. So real estate, um, it says rent, buy, and sell, property for clients, perform duties such as study, property, listings, um, interview, prospective clients, accompany clients to property site, discuss conditions for sit of sale. <laughs> And draw up models of homes and real estate contracts. Um, so you're going to be a real estate receptionist, $20 an hour, 8 a.m. to 4 p.m. Okay. Um, so yeah, you work Monday to Friday. So let's go. Um, yep. <laughs> so she had the other job. So she needs to do charisma level one. So um, we can have her do that. She should do that pretty quickly. That's pretty easy. So she's entered the real estate career pay... I just feel like I said that so weird. Um, Paige is now a real estate receptionist of, um, at Brindleton Bay Realty. She starts Wednesday at 8 a.m. Awesome. Okay, so she acquired the Christmas skill, so she's already gotten this. So that is cool. So she's going to work in 14 hours. So what I usually do is kind of just like, you know, skip through time. When I come back, it'll be almost time for her to go to work. Um, also, you guys, I want to thank you guys again that you actually like these. Um, it actually surprises me how some people really do like to see videos even just on simple careers to see if it's like worth putting in their game because even if they just work like a regular career uh, you know sometimes it's like not worth it to you depending on what it is um i found a couple other ones that one of them i'm super excited for i saw it and i was like oh my god that's so cool <laughs> so yeah i'm excited for that I'll, I'll do a video on that one soon and you know i'll tell you guys all about it in the video i'm excited about it so yes Okay, so it just it told us that work for Paige starts in about an hour, so we're just going to kind of wait um, for that hour to pass. We've got some dirty food over here. Um, so I am assuming this is going to work like every other one, but you never know. Oh my god, we have a vampire at our door. <laughs> That's what happens. Um, I don't know what she just did. Um, but she's about to go to work any minute now, so um, I'm assuming she'll also just go in her regular clothes. I'm always curious about that because I know there has been modded careers before where they do change. Um, but the ones I've done recently, they do not change. So there she goes. She's off to work. So um, she will come back at 4 p.m. So 8 a.m. to 4 p.m. I kind of like those hours, actually. Um those are nice hours. I like it. <laughs> so we're going to go ahead and skip through the day and I'll come back when she comes home with her money and stuff. And we'll also see if she possibly gets a promotion. I think what I'll do is actually have her work hard. Okay, so Paige is now home. She made a hundred, wait, where'd it go? <laughs> she made 160 simoleons and she did some superb work too. So she did not get a promotion, but I did have her work hard. So her fun is very low. Um, and then she's probably going to get a promotion like tomorrow. But what I usually do for these, if you guys have not seen a mod over overview from me before, usually I will just go ahead and promote her with the MC Command Center to kind of just see how each level is. So that's what we're going to do. So we're going to go ahead and go into MC see command center and then we're going to go into cheats and career cheats career promote um okay so she's been promoted to a real estate assistant a page has not been promoted to a real estate assistant she will not make an additional 15 simoleons per hour for a grand total of 35 simoleons per hour and then she received a bonus of 350 so her next shift is thursday at 8 a.m so tomorrow <laughs> and okay so 
Um, we, we like read about the careers like on the website, but it says, <laughs> um, you are still working behind a computer doing the same old skills, but you are now able to write agreements between home buyers and agents. And then it says the next promotion is real estate runner. So I'm pretty sure this is the same description as the website, but we'll go ahead. We'll see. She would need level three of the charisma. So we're going to go ahead and just complete that for her. I just, I'm just doing that with the UI extension mod. Um, I did a video on my must have mods. If you guys, um, easy way to find it or find anyone's if you want to watch anyone's because a lot of simmers have done it is just like type in their username so like if you wanted to search up mine do fantasia must have mods and then you'll see mine um and i talk about like all my must have mods and the ui extension mod is in there because i get a lot of questions about that okay so we're gonna go ahead and promote her again all right cool and now she's been promoted to real estate runner Paige has been promoted to real estate runner she'll now make an additional 15 small years per hour for a grand total of 50 per hour and then she got a bonus of 500 so now she works actually 10 a.m to 6 p.m and she needs oh her cat <laughs> and she needs level four of charisma and then level two of photography which is fun i like that um so yeah Okay, so yeah, these um, descriptions are actually the exact same things I read. If this sounds familiar, you are finally out of the office. Now you'll be placing for sale signs. Yeah, we just read all that, so I'm not going to read that again. Um, I noticed, I think, um, I don't know, maybe I, one or two career overviews I've done have been different descriptions, I think. I don't know. I know one of them had descriptions that I did not read on uh, Mod The Sims. Um, so yeah, sometimes they don't. So I always like to check because if they have different descriptions, I definitely want to read them all out. Um, but yeah, this one seems to have the exact same. So what I can actually, what I may start doing, because I personally prefer to read it over here. It's more exciting <laughs> when I promote them here and read it, but I've already read it. So, um, I think what I might start doing is like, um, show you guys, uh, the creator and stuff like that kind of do a rundown um, on the website and then go into game and I'll read the descriptions out for each thing. Uh, I kind of like that better, <laughs> but I don't want to like repeat myself and read it over again. So yeah, we're going to go ahead and promote her again. Okay, so now she got a bonus of a thousand simoleons, which is awesome. And she's been promoted to buyer's agent. Um, she's going to make an additional 50 per hour for a grand total of 100 per hour. She needs level five of the charisma. So we're going to go ahead and do that for her. And then let's see. So um, we're getting there. All right. So we just promoted her again. Now we got 1,550 bonus. Um, oh, wait, that's the other one. <laughs> so yeah, that was her bonus there that just came in. And then she makes an additional 45 per hour for a grand total of 145. And yeah, she's still a real estate agent. So yeah, it's the same thing. <laughs> the same name for those two levels. So we're at level five now. Um, and then let's go ahead and see level six. So, oh, nope, that's not where we want to go. <laughs> um, see cheats. Let's go ahead and do career cheats, a career promote. Okay. Awesome. So now we got a bonus of 2000. Um, we've been, we've been promoted to a dual agent and she now makes an additional 55 per hour for a grand total of 200 per hour. So that's pretty good. And then reach level seven of charisma. Um, I'm going to have her like do something else. Like go play with the cat, dude. <laughs> well, the cat's going to use the litter box. Never mind. Okay. Well, we'll promote her again and then she'll go play with the cat because she needs some kitty time. She loves her cats. Um, a career promo. Okay. So, um, the next one is, um, a commercial agent and she'll now make an additional 25 per hour for a grand total of 225 per hour. She also received the following bonus 2,250. So now she'll, oh, she works really early now, 7am to 5pm. Okay. Oh, she works kind of long because when we first started, she was working 8 a.m. to 4 p.m. Now it's 7 a.m. to 5 p.m. That's actually pretty long. I'm going to have her call her cat over. <laughs> so we're going to have her max out the charisma. Okay, so she's level 7 now. So we're going to go to level 8. And she's playing with her cat. So career cheats, career promote. There we go. Um, so she just got a bonus of 2,500 and she is the surveyor. So she makes an additional 25 small lines per hour for a grand total of 250 per hour. And then she'll work at 7am to 3pm. Okay. So that's not bad. Oh, I think she's sick. Oh no. 
All right, so we're gonna go ahead and promote her again. MC Cheats, um, Career Cheats, Career Promote. Awesome. So we are now the office manager and she's now making an additional 100 per hour for a grand total of 350 per hour. Um, she also received the following 3,500 bonus. That's awesome. And, um, she needs to reach level 10 of the charisma skill. So, um, you're going to have to be working on that charisma skill for sure. So, um, what am I doing? <laughs> um, so yeah, we have one more to go and then she'll max the career. So let's go ahead and do career sheets, career promo. Okay. So she gets a bonus of 5,000 simoleons for the last one, you guys, and she's an agency owner. So she'll now make an additional 150 per hour for a grand total of 500 per hour, you guys. Oh my goodness. That is crazy. $500 per hour. That's $1,000 in two hours. And she works, um, oh, she doesn't work that long, 12 p.m. to 4 p.m. Okay. Well, still, you make a lot of money, but you just work a lot shorter hours, which is actually kind of nice. Um, I mean, you still work long enough where you're going to make a lot each day. So that's awesome. Um, and she works less days. So she'll be working, um, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday is and Fridays. Um, she'll get the Monday off, which is nice. And yeah, the $5,000 bonus. So, and she doesn't have to do anything for the last one. So that's actually awesome. I really like this career, like a real estate career. I like that. Like there's certain sims that I've had in Let's Plays that I would have loved to have this real estate career for. Um, there's no issues with it. Like usual, I mean, there's definitely careers out there that are kind of buggy. But I feel like now, a okay, if you guys are looking for some good ones, go on to Mod The Sims and literally just... I don't even, you don't even need to like filter it. I just go to Mod The Sims, go to the Sims 4 section, and there's just so many as you're going through the pages. Um, I don't know if it's like a trend or something right now, but there is so many careers being made. I feel like more than before. I mean, there's always been different careers for the game, but I just feel like there's so many lately. Like, so many. I'm gonna have all these careers in my games, in my game. My game is gonna have like an endless amount of careers <laughs> and I feel like maybe I'm wrong but for me personally I've never seen my game like lag or anything from modded careers I guess because it is it's not like this huge mod you know what I mean like they're rabbit hole careers obviously and you know <laughs> so I really like this one you guys um I'll have it linked down below of course if you'd like to have it in your game um and yeah it works great so if you always wanted your sims to be real estate agents or something then definitely download this into your game i like it it definitely fits some sims like there's definitely sims that would totally fit this career so that's exciting i'm excited about it <laughs> i get excited over the little things you know you know so you guys i hope you enjoyed and i hope you guys are all having an amazing amazing day and don't forget to leave some positivity down below i love you guys all so so much and i will see you guys in my next video bye guys You gotta listen up, listen up There's not a thing that I can get from you Boy, I don't need that much, need that much